When Sarah and Marshall Lee remodeled their house, one of their primary goals was to make it energy efficient. They chose a geothermal pump system because it's extremely efficient and one of the most environmentally friendly systems available. Uh, we were looking at uh, alternative energy sources. Uh, we didn't want to have an air conditioner anymore, and uh, we also wanted to uh, stop using natural gas. So uh, we started, we actually heard about it a little bit, but we didn't know much about it. And then we started doing some research, looked at a couple companies, and uh, uh, went with Blue Valley. All right, I'm Dave Petroy with Blue Valley Energy and we do renewable energy heating and cooling systems and technology that we mainly do is geothermal heating systems, heating and cooling, or they're called ground source heat pump systems. And what we do is use the heat energy of the earth to heat your home in the winter and cool it in the summer. Since we already had a forced air system, uh, we just changed that out, took the gas furnace out, uh, Blue Valley took that away and uh, we didn't have to worry about disposing of that, uh, and they retrofit with the, uh, the heat pumps. And the way we do that is we drill holes into the ground. They're about five inch holes, and those go down a couple hundred feet, and we put one inch pipe down. It's a loop that goes down and back, and we circulate quite a bit of water, about 15 gallons a minute, and we can heat your house with air. Or, in the, or we also can transform that to hot water and heat your floors with radiant heating. I mean, it's been wonderful. Uh, you know, it does what it needs to do. It cools us off when we need to be cooled off and warms us up in the winter when we need to be warmed up. So, It's really quite easy. Um, basically, you, if you have a furnace system, we remove the furnace and we put in this unit which is about the same size and shape as the furnace. You modify the ducting a little bit, make sure it hooks up right, and then you don't need the gas hooked to that anymore. We got a letter from uh, the energy company at Excel, and they said, uh, we've noticed that you're not using uh, much elect uh, or gas right now. And uh, so Sarah called uh, the power company up and the gas company and said, uh, yeah, we don't, we don't need it anymore. And we had two alternatives. One, they'd rip out the lines completely, and the other one was just cut off the meter. So. A few days later, they came out and uh, cut the meter off. Catherine and Dennis Long run a business that grows and sells tulip bulbs. Their busiest time of the year is during the summer, and they wanted an energy-efficient way to cool their main building. Part of the, the whole point was to try and take care of a lot of our energy needs in as good a way as possible and use something that was non-polluting. And instead of using natural gas or, like in the case of the PV to, to produce electricity not from a coal fire plant and, and sort of get energy neutral too. It just seems like it makes so much sense to use all that heat that's stored in the ground and make use of it to heat the building or cool it. It's very important now to, real, to model the heating and cooling of the house to make sure you've got the right system and get it sized right. Uh, and then based on that you can actually tell the individuals, how much energy the model suggests you're going to use, what's the cost, how much is it going to save compared to gas, etc. Dave was really good about coming up. He must have come up with three or four different plans for how to do it. And Nice to have <clears throat> options so that then it put it in the ballpark where it was affordable for us, but also gave us thoughts for the future of what we can do too. So yeah, it was, they really worked with us to make it work for us now, you know. The finances are, for renewable are very favorable. Um, basically, it saves, it cuts the energy use by 75%, which I mentioned before. What that translates into is you're going to get your money back in about 10 to 15 years. Now there's a 30% federal tax credit, which, which helps. Um, it's a nice, nice incentive on these systems. The system costs range from Oh, about 16,000 to 33,000 for homes from, say, 1,300 square feet to uh, slightly over 4,000 square feet, so for a single unit. Um, it's an investment, and it's a very, it's a very good investment. Uh, so it, it's like renting or owning. Why not, you know, eventually own it completely and, and pay towards that versus continually having to pay against uh, utilities? And as you know, uh, who, who knows what's going to happen to energy prices, right? And this is another way to invest, and it's probably in these days a, a much sounder investment than, than even the stock market. So.
saves energy, very comfortable, helps with the environment, very simple, low maintenance, reliability.